and 1-877-TELL-HLN. Joining us now, Andrew Smiley, wrongful death attorney. Also with us, Shauna Bowen, a therapist who has been in sweat lodges before. We get her expertise on this. And we welcome back as well, Lynn Lamaster, editor, Prescott, enews.com. She's been covering this story since uh, day one. All right, Andrew, I got to start with you. You hear that quote. A uh, woman is passed out. I'm quoting here. I don't know if she's breathing. Ray says the door has been closed. This round has begun. We'll deal with that at the end of the round. Man, that sounds implicating to me, Andrew. It sure does, Mike. I mean, this is far from a spiritual retreat. This is a torture retreat. I can't believe what I'm hearing uh, as each day progresses of what was going on in here. First, they fast for 36 hours. They cram 50 people in this tent. They sweat them out. People are dropping like flies, and he's telling them to stay in there. I mean, it is absolute torture. This guy should definitely be criminally prosecuted for manslaughter for the deaths. He and his company are facing a civil litigation uh, that, in my mind, is a slam dunk for all the injuries and deaths how do they let this happen these people are spending what I've heard is about ten thousand yeah. dollars to go on this retreat you expect there to be some level of safety and security going on here y exactly Shauna again you have not been in a James Ray uh -huh. sweat lodge correct so it's just mind-boggling on so many fronts here I'm gonna bring back Andrew Smiley attorney specializes in wrongful death cases Andrew you and I our jaws we got to pick them up off the desk here when we hear that uh, and again he hasn't been charged with anything but from right. Shauna's account he looked away as someone actually called his name um, yeah man it it's unreal, you know, if this was just, you know, in a park setting and someone's sitting there not doing anything, you'd be stunned by it if people are dropping like flies all around. But here, he's the leader. People are actually paying him. If you multiply 50 by the 10,000 a pop, I mean, you're looking at over a half a million dollar gig here, and the guy is just, uh, uh, you know, ignoring the people that are there to follow his leadership. He's not rendering help. He's not rendering assistance. He doesn't have people on standby to render proper aid, knowing that he's putting people in a dangerous situation. It is absolutely unbelievable and there needs to be an investigation and this guy has to be uh, held accountable for what he's done okay again we appreciate okay. your insights and Andrew sure. always having you uh, always good having you aboard as well thanks appreciate Mike. it uh,